Okay, welcome dads, mums, families listening. Probably literally the best treat we're ever going to have. We have got today in the studio Florence and Eden. And I've invited Florence and Eden, yay, to do an interview episode with us. Last week's episode with Kerry was what stressed dads, what women want stressed dads to know. And a member of our group suggested, well, can we ask the kids what they want stressed dads to know? So we've got a whole a whole bunch of questions here. And um, I'm a little bit nervous, to be honest. Uh, we This is the first run through. We haven't um, practiced this at all. Uh, so we're just going <laughs> to I'm just going to fire away with the questions, all right? So, um, you've said your names. Florence, what is the best thing about your life right now? Being, get a bit closer to the mic. being able to have a family like this. Have a family like ours? Great answer. And what is it specifically that you like about our having a family like this? How... Oh. What, what one thing do you like? I like that at one point every week we're always together. At least one point per week we're always together. Great answer. Thank you. Eden, what is the best thing about your life? Eden's just thinking at the moment. <laughs> Shall I come back to that question? Yes. <laughs> okay. Uh, can you introduce us to your new nungi today? Hello. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think a daddy's job is? Um, to work. Well, the mums look after the children, so the life, um, so that that family's life is better. Great. And what about a daddy's job around the children? Does daddy have any jobs around the children? <gasps> okay. Um, to look after them. And yes, thank you. Great. Yes, to look after you. Perfect. Yes, Eden. Mm. Having a lovely family. That's the favourite thing about your life right now? Yes. Okay, thank you. That's the, and what about your teeth? How many teeth have you got? Can we call new ones? One. Oh, wow. That was a great one. Florence is just about to lose another tooth, aren't you, Florence? And it's very exciting. Can't quite get it out yet, can we? <laughs> so when Daddy's face is... Uh, what's Daddy's face like? So this is all about stress, letting go of stress, relieving stress permanently. Um, what is when Daddy's... Daddy, <laughs> the kids will refer to grump to stress as grumpiness. What is daddy? What's da what's daddy's face like when he's grumpy? And he's not smiling, is he? What is it like, Florence? Okay. So when daddy's when daddy's stressed, um, I hate myself. Oh my gosh, that's what I'm like. Exactly like that. Um, so what when daddy is stressed and angry what what do you want to do what does that what do you want to do when we're stressed and angry um, go and tell mommy and daddy and leave myself alone okay leave yourself alone okay what about you florence i think maybe give them some time to um be happy again yes and, and what can they do 
to become happier when we get stressed and angry? I guess you could have more time having fun with your family. Mm, yeah, more fun with family, less work time. And I guess a bit more sleep. Oh, always a bit more sleep. Yes, thank uh, you. Um, and when daddy is stressed and angry, um, you know how that feels, don't you? How does that feel for you when daddy is stressed and angry? Um, Can you describe that? It's like a tornado has just hit you. Oh my god. And gosh. the tornado is now inside of you. Oh, and that's how it feels for you? Oh my gosh, what a lovely description. Disgusting. So, so that does not that so that doesn't <laughs> feel very nice, does it? And Eden has described it with one word. What was the word, Eden? Disgusting. <laughs> Florence? Uh, actually, Eden, you first. Wow. Eden, what is the scariest thing you can think of happening to you? Mm. Same question for you, Florence, in a moment. Being killed. Being killed. <laughs> <laughs> what, by a truck? Uh, by anything. So, yeah, how about you, Florence? It's probably not having a home to live in. Yes, you know, so somewhere that where you don't belong actually mm. yeah that is most that's the most scary thing i can think of as well but that was really good answers thank you <laughs> okay next question then um eden what is love how would you describe love i have no idea is, so there's nothing on the planet you've ever loved <laughs> No. You don't love nungies. You don't. I love, love them. <laughs> I love everything. You love it, and how does it make you feel when you love something in your body? Happy. Happy. So love and happy are very similar, aren't they? What about you, Florence? It's a nice feeling, and you feel like you belong with them. Mm. And have you got something? What happens when you feel loved? Have you got an example of <gasps> feeling loved? Can you sit down, please? Um, what makes you feel that feeling often? I guess having a little time to myself so that I don't become angry. Mm. And do you like spending time with mummy or daddy to feel yeah. loved? Yeah. yeah. What about you, Eden? Um, having time with mummy and daddy. On your own or as a family? Um. <laughs> Golly gosh. Thank you for your answer, Eden. <laughs> Is it important to you that daddy loves mummy as much as he does? Yeah. Yeah? How do you know daddy loves mummy? Because we married each other. That's one way. I yeah. can feel that you're together. Um, mm. You're always around each other. Mm. You kiss. Smoochity smoochy. Blech, blech. Oh, I like that. <laughs> Shall we have a polo break a moment? Yeah. Lawrence, do you want to go and get your polos? Eden, you just stop there a moment. So you got you can keep answering questions. Okay, we can get you something else from the plan. So Eden, whose job is it to love you? Mummy and Daddy's. Yes. And whose job is it for you to love? My family. Yeah, the best you can. It's not your job to love Mummy and Daddy, is it? That's Mummy's job to love Daddy and Daddy's job to love Mummy. Thank you, Florence. Can I have something when you lay down? <laughs> yeah. 
My dad just air boogie. <laughs> okay. Um, what what one thing? What one thing can daddies do to be better daddies? Eden, you first. Love your children. Mm-hmm. And and so, most daddies would say, "I love my children." But what would a daddy have to do to show that he loves their children? To have time with them. That's the most important thing to you. And if a daddy isn't spending time with his children, is that hard for them to feel that he loves them? Mm-mm. Sorry, you don't think so? Because they're working for you. Mm. And it's really interesting that Eden's answer is, is time. And Florence, you could appreciate that if daddy's out to work and say, well, he's out working for the family. So he still loves us because he's provided money. And that's really important, isn't it? How old are you, Eden? Six. How old are you, Florence? Eight. Have, have they been eight and six great years on the planet Earth? Mm-hmm. Yeah. So, Eden, what would you like to do differently in your life if you had a magic wand? Mm, have my own puppy and a horse. Florence? What was the question? What would you like to do differently if you had a magic wand? What would you change? And again, yeah. I change how big the garden was Mm -hmm. so that we can have more time outside in the summer and do lots of playing. Mm. Like we could have um, a seesaw and all that and the rail and stuff. Because it's bigger. Oh, that would be great, wouldn't it? Okay, so you guys have done amazing. Um, what can daddies do? What what one piece of advice would you give to dads who are listening, who want to be a better husband and better daddy? Um, to love their children and their wife. Is that the most important thing in the world? Mm, not really. What do you think is the most important thing in the world then? Having fun. Having fun is the most important thing in the world. With each other? Yes. Yes. Um, to work because it makes you happy. And then after working, you could spend like an hour with each of your children to make up for the time. That's a brilliant answer. Thank you. So you both get to ask Daddy one question each to finish the interview. You've both been amazing. Probably the best people I've had in this studio so far. But you have to pay me to be here, all right? Uh, So I have to pay you five pounds and you five pounds, all right? I don't even have five pounds. (laughs) She only has four. So you get to ask Daddy one question each. What would you like to ask Daddy? What is your best thing in your life? My family. I would say that. Florence? What do you like best about your work? Oh, um, that you wake up every day and you know that you've made a tiny difference in someone's life for them to be happier and yeah it makes me want to cry so i love you too how are you why is that because i would cry (laughs) so i love you I love you both. You're the most amazing things in the world. Um, I love your front teeth. <laughs> Just lucky in it because we've seen them a lot in this interview. So they haven't seen the video part. Um, would you? <laughs> any any last words, Florence? Do you want to um, 
say anything encouraging to all the people listening and all the mums actually that's lovely <laughs> all the mums listen have you got any encouragement for the mums listening try your best to not get frustrated when your kids frustrate you oh that's a good one my gosh i mean i don't find that very hard at, at all <laughs> 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 and what about you, Eden? Have you got some good words for mummies listening? Have fun in your life. And if someone's not having much fun, what should they do? Just have some time on their own. Mm, to unwind and relax. Okay. Thanks, you guys. You've been amazing. Is there anything else you want to say? Thank <laughs> you.